Good evening again from the backyard. Uh, CIA is torturing people, and this is not an American thing to be doing. According to this article from American Free Press, Mark Danner is showing that the Americans are still torturing people. And uh, uh, they've got these camps that they're supposed to be doing away with. And uh, this one person confessed uh, to being a mastermind of 9-11, and he was over to Guantanamo. Uh, he was waterboarded boarded, uh, over a hundred times. And there are all sadistic tortures going on. Uh, it said over here, um, suffocation by water, beatings by use of a collar, beating and kicking, confinement in the box. So, I mean, all these different things are going on. And Mark Danner is showing that uh, uh, these things are a part of our national policy, apparently. What kind of a government do we have? We think we're all very nice. You see all these nice businessmen uh, all dressed up in nice suits, three-piece suits and all that kind of stuff, walking around Washington, giving nice talks and everything. Well, we, if we're hiring uh, thugs to, to go around and kill people around the world or torture them, and we still have these camps going on, uh, we're not a very nice uh, bunch of people. And once you take soldiers and uh, put them in the army, and you start training them to kill, well, some of them become sadistic. And what happened over here, uh, it said over here in this article, um, April 11, 2001, that it's unconscionable the soldier in Bravo Company, uh, Kandahar, uh, executed people. And then what they did, this corporal, he's showing it like it's a trophy. He's holding the, the head up like a, if he has a, a, a dead deer or something over there. I mean, this, this is the height of sadism. Uh, no, we, we, we don't want our soldiers going over and being subjected to all types of mental stress and some of them kicking out and becoming sadistic or crazy. Uh, and then we don't treat them well when they, when they come back in. So the point is, we have to start taking care of our soldiers and please make sure that we stop all these rampant wars, Yemen, Fourth War, Libya, a, a second war. We have soldiers over there under the United Nations con control <coughs> and uh, French control. We want a government that's protected by the United States, and we want the citizens protected by the United States. Uh, <clears throat> if the good people don't do anything, the bad people will take over. Well, they've taken over pretty much in this country, I'm sorry to say. Speak up for America, please, and pray for America. Thank you very much for watching.